Okay, hello everyone. Today we're gonna be playing Avatar Rogue Benders. Yo, this game is actually decent. It has a lot of potential. So yeah, if you want to see that, stay tuned. Let's go. Okay, so first off, the game is pretty decent, but it doesn't have a lot to do. You can farm some money, you can get your skills, you can... Is he trying to attack me? Okay. Let's see the... the... You think you're better than me, bro? Come on. Bro, come on, man. You don't need to do this to yourself, you know? I am better than you. Where do you think you're going? Come on! Okay. Also, GG's, <laughs> bro, it wasn't even fair, okay, anyways, as I was saying, guys, uh, you can get some abilities, so basically, what you need to do is go here, click once on this, click to meditate, and there are gonna appear some, uh, like, uh, letters, and you will click on the keyboard, and that's how you meditate, every five times, you get uh, some wisdom and some energy. I think you get energy after you get your first move. I'm not sure. Don't uh, don't hold my word on that. Okay, you see, five times you get something. You get like uh, it's randomized. You can get between for wisdom, it's between like four and twenty, and for energy, it's like two and ten, something like that. I'm not a hundred percent sure. So yeah, but as you saw, the 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 PVP is decent. But it's kind of really uh, focused on long range, so you need to be careful with that. Like airbenders have a lot of range and they just spam and you need to fight with them like, like it's crazy. It's not even PvP, it's like trying to dodge basically every single move of theirs. So yeah, it's fine. So now I'm gonna go and show you how to get some food because as you can see, I'm kind of hungry, so yeah. Okay, here we are. We like to buy. Uh, we'd like to buy some ca some cabbages and eat them. Yeah, very good. You can also find cabbages in like uh, the Earth Kingdom and grab them for free. And also, you can find some berries in the um, the forest, I think. And you can eat that as well. So yeah. Also, I'm gonna show you right now. Uh, you can buy some stuff. It's pretty cool. You can buy some armor, some stuff like that. Like here. Uh, buy, uh, hooks, uh, swords, they do not work for some reason. I'm not sure. And here you can buy some masks. How you train. Is basically you need some money. And you need uh, the EXP for certain stuff, okay? I'm going to show you right now. Okay, so... Here, this is the best quest in my opinion. Like you get uh, two, two fifty, I think, two hundred and fifty cash, and it's really easy to complete. You just need to climb here. Someone tried to attack me, and he, if he did put me in co combat, I would have killed him. So lucky he did not. You just climb like this. You find the flower, you pick it up, and then you drop down. That simple. That easy. Where is the person? I'm gonna kill him. I just need to find him. You see, 250. Easy. And the first trainer for fire is here. You get a fire jab and a fire combo. This one is not that crazy, to be completely fair with you. So, yeah. I'm gonna I'm kill the guy who tried to attack me. It's this guy. Right? It's him. It has to be.
Come on, bro. Where are you going? Where do you think you're going? <laughs> I'm kicking them so freaking weirdly. It's funny. Let me pick this guy up. You attack me first. Oh, really? Where do where do I put him? Hmm. Nah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna just kill him. Bloom. Easy. You see, it's not that hard to kill people here. It's really easy. You get some cash, but... I do not recommend that because you can get, like, bad karma and people can put you in jail. So be careful with that. Also, um, you can spin for stuff. There are some codes. You can find them in their Discord uh, here. You can you can get like a family and trait. I there are some decent traits. There are some decent families. They do certain stuff, but I as you can see I got nothing because uh, my luck. Haha, <laughs> it's very, very uh, not good. And for bending, it, it's really all up to you. Like the game is uh, relatively balanced. It's okay, but in my opinion, earth is decent. Fire is decent. Water is okay, you can get uh, blood bending, but I think the water is is probably the the worst one, in my opinion, okay? Don't freaking go crazy over that, okay? So yeah, water is probably the worst one, air and fire might be the best, so yeah, you do you, do you with that information. What the hell is that? What? Oh, there... <laughs> Are you gonna attack me, little girl? Oh. <laughs> oh no, he's running. No. Oh, he's gonna run away? Are you sure about that? Are you certain about that, bruh? I mean, I will kill you. Why not? Ah, he he didn't have any money. Bad. Shouldn't have hit, shouldn't have killed him. Honestly. Also, there are uh, different weapons, guys. There's there are like these hammers. There's like the water tribe stick or whatever, the sword. Uh, there's um, what it what's it called? The ends uh, um, staff. You can get that. It's pretty decent. Like, you can fly with it, so it's pretty cool. So, yeah. The game is pretty decent, it's fun. If you want to see, like, a full guide on it, uh, make sure to drop a comment. Because, like, the game is fun. I've been playing it for, like, a few hours. And, yeah, it's really good. So, yeah, I think that's gonna be it for today's video. If you guys liked it, make sure to like, share, subscribe, and all that shit. If you have any suggestions, drop them down in the comments. And that's gonna be it. See you guys in the next video. Goodbye.